I was back here with another video, so we're opening up some more packs, man. I just sold everything that I pulled from the first pack opening because we don't want no amethyst, man. We're going for that diamond pull, so why not just sell everything? The amount of shoe boost that I had was honestly insane. So it showed on this menu down here, right here, it said I think like 88 or something, and then I had like five of each one. So I had like 400 plus shoe boosts and that took years to sell. I will just tell you that much right now, but hey man, we're back at it again. Let's keep going with these base packs and let's see that diamond, man. So we got 133k and we started off last video with 68k. So we just about doubled our MT from opening up packs, which is kind of crazy. If we could do that again that would be even more crazy i don't know if i just i probably just got pretty lucky i mean I, I was getting some pretty good packs i'm not gonna lie but let's just continue i mean let's get into it if you're new to the channel please make sure to subscribe give away at 500 subscribers and also please make sure to leave a like leave a like on the video man that's always much appreciated Gonna start things off with a Troy Brown Jr. Second pack, we got Cam Whitmore Gold. And we do got a shake in there. Third pack in. Third pack in, man. Oh, that's gonna be another Amethyst. Please be AK at least. Shooting guard, it's going to be Manu again. Which I'm not mad about. I mean, another Amethyst three packs in. Do we, of course, wish that that was a diamond? Yes, man, but... This man is we'll be back at it again. I mean, we're, we're not mad at seeing him again. Gold Andre Jackson. I think he was, he was Yukon, I believe, is where he was at. Gold Devontae Graham. I honestly completely forgot that Devontae Graham even existed. I haven't thought about that man in like over a year. I'm just keeping it real. He, he had some good moments too, man. I mean, I don't know what happened. Got a day one Terry. We got a Sapphire here. What do we got? We got Sapphire SGA. Who you guys know I'd take him first round in my fantasy league. There's no way that I did that I don't. He absolutely balled out for me last year. And that Thunder team, man, look out. I think that they're kind of ready to take some names, man. 2-0 and on the season. And they're going to be a playoff team. I don't think there's any doubt about it. Got Ruby Buddy healed. Good to see him again. So, again, a pretty good start right there, man. That is... We profited pretty heavily on that box. With that Amethyst and Ruby, we about doubled our MT there on that first box, which is good to see. We didn't, you know, ultimately get what we wanted, but... First pack of this box. Gold Isaiah Stewart. You know, there's Sapphire here. It's going to be Sapphire Sergio, who is, it's going to be at the point where I've pulled him a ton. Let's just put it that way. Got an Emerald Isaiah Stewart. I didn't even know that he was in the set. That kind of took me off guard a little bit. He might be, he might be all right. I mean, he's probably going to be an undersized card, but maybe a power forward. He might be a really good, like, defender.
old Isaiah Joe, who is, he's a sneaky player too, man. He, he, he's got some potential. Okay, we got Zeke Naji. Got Matisse Thibel. And another Shaker. Shakers in back-to-back -back boxes, man. And it's gonna be another Amethyst. Kinda saw that coming. I kinda did, but... I can't complain. I mean, two Amethysts in 17 packs is kinda wild. And a Ruby to go with it. So our luck is kinda continuing off of the first video of these packs, man. And it's gonna be AK. So that's even better. AK's got more quick sale value. And AK is also the better card. I don't think there's any doubt about that. Big dub there. We got an Emerald Dead Center. We got Gary Payton the second again. We got. Kristaps here, who just, man, I mean, I, I said this before, but he's just, it's rough that the Celtics have him, and it's not good. For the rest of the Eastern Conference, especially the Heat. Last pack of this box, we got another Gary Payton the second, who seems to be by far the most common Emerald pull out of these packs. Alright, let's, let's just keep this, the Shaker streak going here. Another game, dude. What is going on, man? Got an Amethyst coach, which is always a nice little troll there. You know they gotta throw that at you occasionally. Got a gold Kobe Brown. Emerald Jamal Murray. Gold Luca Garza. I forgot that he existed too, man. I'll, I'll be real. Emerald Jalen Brown. Okay. That's... This is very random, but... Noticing... A lot of guys, and it's just because we've opened up so many packs, man. I mean, this is a ridiculous amount of packs. I've never opened up this amount of packs in one sitting before, but... A lot of guys in the NBA I've noticed with the same last name, man. There's a lot of Browns. There's a lot of, uh, I can't even remember what the other couple that I've noticed is, but... I don't know, I know that that's totally random, but okay, we got Sapphire, Jason Tatum. Here we got a gold Kai Jones, man. Who, uh, of course, whenever you see him, you just think of that clip with that, with the famed Hornets announcer just going absolutely ballistic on that dunk that he did. Sam Merrill. All right, last pack. Getting this one off. So, finally cooled off a little bit there. But still, really not too bad at all. I mean, two Amethysts and another Ruby out of three 10 pack boxes. I mean, that is. I think we definitely would have profited again off of those three boxes. So, let's just keep the streak going. Let's keep going. Let's see. I mean, we gotta be due for a diamond 2K, man. It's, I don't know how many times I've said that while opening up these packs, but... Just one time, man. Just one time. Holy crap, so... 250 pack agenda, and we hit the 150 pack agenda, like two or three boxes in. Last video, so... 
kind of wild. Okay, we got gold radiators. Got an emerald Drew Holiday. He was another really good pickup for the Celtics too. And then back to back, just just rubbing it in even more. Oh, that would have been insane if that was three in a row Drew Holiday. I was low key hoping that it was. All right. Gold Max Struess. We've got an Emil Jaron Jackson Jr. We have got Gold Chris Livingston. Ruby Coach, Ruby Eric Spolstra. Very uh, slight W there on that one. I'll take that all day. I'll always take an Aaron Spolster. Most underrated coach of all time. Yes, I know he's considered one of the greatest coaches of all time, but to me, he's top three. And I don't know if he gets that kind of credit, but I think he's for sure top three. Okay, we got Emerald Anthony Edwards to end off that box. So now it's selling time. Got a token there. And another thing too, with and it hasn't happened once in this video yet, but last video, the amount of holographics that I was pulling was honestly insane. It makes me think that they they upped the odds on holographics. I think they had to win. I don't think there's any way that they didn't. Alright, we've got a few more here. Kobe Brown, man, yeah, we'll see what, he was pretty good at Purdue in college, so we'll see, you know, if he pans out. Kind of one of those just really big body centers that could really be a bully in the post, I feel like. Devontae Graham, man, did not realize that he was a spur, I'm going to be real. I have no idea. And what's really crazy is, I've seen a few diamond pulls, man. I've definitely seen a few diamond pulls out of these packs. Out of the base packs too, specifically. Because I just think people realize, like, there is no reason to open up the deluxe packs at all. Like, there's just really no reason to. Okay, we got a gold Bryce Sensabaugh. Gold DeAndre Hunter. Yeah, if you guys, you know, if you're just interested in collector level, these packs are for you. That's what I would tell you. Okay, we got a De'Aaron Fox, and um, thanks for letting me know about that dynamic. I'll definitely put that to use. Definitely not. But thank you anyway. Gold Tobias Harris, who he looked good against the Bucks, man. He was, I mean, his shot looked better than I've ever seen his shot look. Gold Rudy Gobert. Yeah, this box is, man, 
I mean, we could always get saved by some here, but this box is just not looking good. Okay. Patrick Williams. Najee Marshall. He had that little spurt last year of a few games where he was looking like... It was kind of like a TJ Warren-esque thing, you know, just for a few games there, it looked really, really elite, but then, I don't know, just really cooled off after that. Oh, Ruby dead center, see? That's what I mean there, a nice little savior in this box. Ruby X-Man. And we've pulled him a few times by now, too. Alright, so that's the theme here. Let's sell and go. Let's sell and rip. Get X-Man out of there and we'll get in the next box. If this if these couple videos though tell you anything, it should be that it is very hard to pull diamond. And it should also tell you that sub two percent compared to two percent. And I've already said this, I know, but sub 2% compared to 2%, man, is just, the difference is just unbelievable. It's so much more of a difference than you would ever think. Okay, we do have another, oh, it's a coach, man, that was a troll. I thought that was definitely a player. Dem Vassell had a pretty good game one against the Mavericks. Darren Fox. Gary Payton the second again, so that's about twenty Gary Paytons, I would say. Gold Shuma Okiki. It's Chuma's first appearance, and I think that this is another Ruby coach, which is just... It's just terrible, man. I, <laughs> I don't even know what to say. That's just such a troll. Gold Chris Murray. Gold Jared Vanderbilt. Okay. And another just nice little clutch ruby right there to end off this box. And it's going to be another ruby buddy healed, which I will take all day, man. Not the ultimate goal here, but I'm not going to get mad at a ruby. I'll never get mad at a ruby until their quick sell value is like less than 5k, which that's going to be a long time. Gonna be a long time before that is the case. All right, sell and rip. Let's get into the next box here. Start things off with a gold PJ Tucker. Nice little sapphire action here. We have got another Sergio. Okay. Back to back. And this one's going to be Kawhi. Who, I, I don't think I've pulled Kawhi before. Gold Sim Bular, that's only about the second or third Sim card. He seems pretty rare. Gold Aaron Neesmith. Gold AR-15. Kira Lewis Jr., who I, I've not thought about him in a long time either. He kind of was another one that 
just kind of, he had a couple games where he was looking really good, but then, I mean, that happens with everyone, though. I mean, the NBA players, they're in the NBA for a reason. They're going to have a, a game where they kind of look like they're elite. Well, they're all elite, but they're going to have a game where they look like the best of the best sometimes. Okay, so that box, it's been a while since we pulled an Amethyst now, which is a little bit unfortunate, but it is what it is, though, because we had, you know, we've had some good streaks here. We'll just sell all these lead cars. We might even have to sell an Amethyst here again, but that's all right. I wish that there was, and I was wishing this when I was quick selling all my consumables last year. There should just be a sell all button. Like, please, you can make that happen. They've never done that, but for people, I'd open up a ton of packs. I would just be like, oh, man, that would be absolutely elite if there was a sell all button. I know people have wanted it for like shoes and stuff for a long time. People have been asking for that for a long time, but I don't know if we'll ever really, if we'll get that though. Because we haven't yet, you know what I mean? So, alright, what do we got here? We got Sapphire Sergio. Yeah, let's just go for Broke Man. Let's sell off the Amethyst again, and let's just keep this train rolling. So we're back to 121. We only have lost 12k and we've opened up like five boxes again. So I mean these packs are Yeah, I mean we're due for a dime. That's what comes down to. Come on, 2k. Johnny Davis Gold. Gold Xavier Tillman, who is, he's looking like a starting center man. I mean, when he gets time on the floor as a starter, like he is now with Steven Adams out, I mean, he looks good. Third pack, we've got a gold Jordan, good one. We have got Emerald Kyrie. Okay, another Ruby. That's good to see. Another Buddy healed. He's been a little bit. Gold Nikolajovic. Gold Joe Harris. Okay, another Sapphire. This one is Sergio again. So yeah, I mean, it is kind of looking like Giannis is a limited time card. It's kind of from what I'm seeing. It's looking like there's going to be... Either they'll remove him and put in some someone else tomorrow, like they did with the Possessed sets in 2K21, or they'll just keep him and add another player tomorrow. Because with the 9-hour timer, then... I don't know. I'm still kind of confused on what's exactly going on, but we'll find out tomorrow. Garrison Matthews to end it off. So, Ruby out of the first one here. Yeah, those, those Ruby coaches are just so troll. I'm not even going to lie. We're about due for a shake here, though. It's been like three or four boxes. I think this is the longest we've gone without a shake. Gold Greg Dick. Who has not really been getting any minutes from what I'm seeing. 
Go Kobe Brown. Yeah. And another Gary Payton. Good to see you again. Gold Reggie Evans. Gold Thomas Bryant. That's the first time pulling him. And he's been looking. I mean, he's kind of... I don't know how I felt about him on the Heat. I mean, he's had some good moments and some bad moments, too, so far. But it's only two games in. So you can't really judge a player off that small of a sample size. We got Trey Young. Ice Trey coming out. And it's kind of like with, with, uh, with Drew Smith tonight for the Heat. Big time lag there. I don't know if my audio lagged or not, but that was a huge lag. But yeah, it's kind of like Drew Smith for the Heat tonight. He, uh, he's he been, you know, back and forth between the G League for a couple years. He hasn't gotten really any time on the floor in the NBA. Started off terrible. Okay, like his first, like, five minutes on the floor, it was, it was bad. Had a couple bad turnovers, had some bad defensive moments, but then he started playing well, and everyone was freaking out at first, and I was just like, just let the man get his feet wet, you know, you gotta, you gotta give some players some time, you know, this is the biggest game of his life, you gotta give him a break. And then you kind of proceeded to hit some threes, play some better defense, you know, the shot was looking really good. He went like four or five from three or something like that, so. You gotta give players a chance. They're not just gonna come in right away and be elite. And these packs are they're um they're really starting to cool off. So we might be we might be hitting the here. Which is kinda unfortunate because it's been a good run, but it's not over yet. We could clutch something out here. And we still will have another boss set after selling Buddy Heal. Okay, we got a Sapphire, another Sergio. With that weird NBA ball from whatever year that was, like 2006 or something. I don't think it was 2006, but sometime around there where everyone hated it, so they just switched back to a normal ball. <laughs> Gold Tory Craig didn't look too bad at all for the Bulls. Gold Andrew Nemhard, who I think is another guy that needs some more minutes. I know it's kind of hard with the Pacers because they got a good starting backcourt, but... And he gets some starting time sometimes, but it, uh, some of these young guys, they need, they need 30 minutes a game, I think. Okay, so that's that's quite a few boxes there in a row without a shaker, which is it's a little bit unfortunate. All right, sell and rip. Let's, let's get going here. It's kind of it's looking like we're reaching in, but hopefully not. Hopefully we can just get a box. A box with two shakers would be insane. It has not happened yet, but. this I got to go back to again this just shows you why there should not be sub 2% or at least you know show the odds maybe show it then and then it's like a point five. but like sub 2 just keeps everybody guessing and I don't, I don't think that's good I think you got to be straight up with your consumers you know Got a huge lag there again. Nikola Vucevic. JD Davison. Dude, 
That was the weirdest logo. I just I skipped over it fast, but I think it was like a really, really old Celtics logo or something. But we're gonna have to take a look at that. That was that was pretty funny. I'm not gonna lie. Okay, we do have a Ruby. That's pretty clutch. That's pretty clutch. Another buddy healed. We did just get a Sapphire prize ball, which is a pretty good pull. I think that's pretty rare, too, because I don't think I've pulled... Well, I have pulled an animal prize ball, so I, that's the first Sapphire or above prize ball I've ever pulled out of a pack. So kind of an interesting box here. We got a Sapphire prize ball. We got the weirdest logo I've ever seen. That would have just been the right time right there to clutch out with Don. But then it ended off with Isaiah Hardenstein on that one. Starting to lose hope a little bit here. Yeah, we, we have to look at this logo, man. What was that, dude? Like, oh my god. 64 65 Celtics, bro. It, it's not as funny now. It was funnier, like, when I saw it just for a split second, but that's still pretty. That's still pretty funny, though. And kind of dope. I mean, that's, that's a sick error for the Celtics. They were, they, none of those players getting nearly the credit that they should. Like, Hondo, Bill Russell, of course. Bill Russell gets the credit, but Hondo, Sam Jones. I mean, just some elite pioneers of the game, man. Deserve more credit, for sure. There's no doubt. So we did get, we had a buddy healed there. Gonna have to sell some lead guys here again. So this also means too, man, that we are going to be back with more packs tomorrow. New cards are added. And that also means that I should have quit a line a long time ago. But man, I just want to pull a diamond. I don't know how many times I have to say it to you, kid, but I'm just gonna continue to try and speak it into existence. Isaiah Joe. Keon Ellis, gold. And yeah, I apologize to you, man, but I will not be watching these videos back through because this is going to be like way over an hour. So if there's anything weird with the audio, I know I've had some weird lag spikes and stuff, just let me know because I've had audio issues in the past. As we get a ruby prize ball, which that should be pretty good. A sapphire and a ruby prize ball now in the last couple 10 pack boxes. Anthony Simons, very unfortunate injury for him. Patrick Baldwin. Yeah, I think 2K. They were just like. That's enough packs for you, is what they're saying. Is what they're trying to tell me. You need to quit ripping packs and go to bed, sir. Is what they're trying to tell me. So, okay, I think that that is pretty much going to do it for tonight. Because we... Yeah, we don't have a root beer now with this dirty thing to sell. So we're not going to get back to 38k, but... Yeah, man, hope you guys enjoyed that very long pack opening. By far the most packs I've ever opened up in one sitting. And that should tell you right there, man. That was like 15 10-pack boxes or so. And no diamond. We got, I think like 6 amethysts. We got probably like 10, maybe even more rubies. And no diamonds to show for it. So, kind of unfortunate, but hopefully, man, 
I'm trying to open up a ton of packs tomorrow. Hopefully that diamond will come tomorrow. Yeah, but yeah, if you guys watched all the way through all of this, thank you guys so much, man. It, it, it really is much appreciated. Please make sure to subscribe to the channel if you're new. We uh, will be doing a giveaway at 500 subscribers, so do not miss out on that. Get yourself some MT, some BC. And also leave a like in the video, man. That's always much appreciated, but... And also, uh, yeah, like I said, I won't be watching these through or anything, so if there's any audio issues, any thing like that, just leave a comment below. But yeah, man, with all that being said, I will see you guys in the next vid. E. O. Oh.